Hi everyone! Today is a summer day in my life in Tokyo, Japan, my first day of summer vacation. So let's do some shopping and some cooking and a lot more. Okay, so now I am in Shinjuku. I finished with the school for today. I'm officially on summer break. Yay! But sadly, uh, Yuki's not on summer break, and most of my friends aren't on summer break. So it's just me solo today. I am starving. I'm gonna get some food here. And this is called the Meat Lab Company, I believe. Um, it's my first time eating here, but I chose this place because they are going to let me substitute rice for salad, which is very kind of not common in Japan to actually let you substitute rice out for something else. I got the hamburger steak with avocado. Today being a Thursday, a weekday, in the early afternoon, it's not very busy here, so it's good, and I'm able to keep social distancing. I have my mask with me. Uh, there's, no, there's only like three other parties here at the restaurant right now, and we're all keeping a safe distance. After I'm done eating, I'll do some shopping before it starts getting too crowded. I'll also probably walk around Shinjuku a little bit too. I am, however, trying to save some money for my birthday weekend, which is coming up in just a few days. Sauce that you saw on the avocado, and that's like a wasabi sauce. Thankfully, I like wasabi. Mm. Okay, so let me eat my lunch first, and I'll be right back. Standing in the hallway, I know you know what I'm about to tell you. I just realized. This is my favorite, favorite bug spray. You guys should try it. It smells awesome. So I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be for the Olympics, but you know, that's not happening. So honestly, I didn't really see anything that spoke out to me. Um, I don't know, but I did see like there were a lot of things on sale. I'm assuming that business is bad and they're struggling a bit because normally they don't really have too many sales in department stores in Japan unless it's like, uh, like New Year's or sometimes they'll have like a golden week sale, but um, so yeah, like I would normally, that's not the case. So anyways, I did see quite a lot of sales and, but overall like, yeah, nothing spoke out to me too much as far as fashion wise, trend wise. So like the ongoing trends right now are like things that are sheer, things that are new to pastel colors, monochromatics very in right now. Also, uh, loose oversized tees with like kind of baggy pants are sort of in as well. Mm -hmm. 
It's a crazy Monday. I know it shows that I'm a little nervous. I just realized that. some things that I'll show you guys when I get home but as for now I need to go home I'm gonna make Yuji dinner because I had a nice lunch and he didn't so I'm gonna make him dinner so look forward to that also we are going to go grocery shopping Shinjuku station has been remodeled because I am lost and everything seems a lot more spacious. Usually I'm I'm really good with directions, so I am lost. Okay, maybe I'm not lost, it's just that everything's very unfamiliar right now. It's like I'm a tourist. How do you know which one is good? My instinct tells me which one's good. Oh, it's expensive, a dollar fifty-eight. A little bit. Do you want one? No, it's okay. Oh, maybe now because you touched it. Look, so sour cream is two hundred and eighteen yen. It's two dollars and eighteen cents. Look how small this is. My friend on Instagram, she says these are really good. Yeah. Traveling mochi. Get them all? Oh, yes, get them all. Our favorite. Konyaku pudding. These are the best. Either that one or this one. This one looks good too. Let's look at the carbs. 8.4 gram. Can I get it? You choose. You're the vision. Let's try this one. Okay, let's try this one. Cold gyoza. Okay, so we are back home from the supermarket. My battery died while I was there. So I'm just about to make dinner. I'm gonna make some dinner. I'm gonna make a Mexican Santa Fe chicken casserole. So first I'm gonna start by seasoning the chicken. Hold on. I got this. It's just a lot easier to do in Japan. This is what I'm gonna use. I'm gonna season the chicken first. I'm gonna pan fry it and then I'm gonna put it into a casserole dish and put some cheese and bell peppers and onions and it's gonna be good. Okay, so now that I have them a little bit charcoaly, crispy on the outside, they're not cooked on the inside, but I'm going to cut it up and put it back into the casserole dish. Voila! Okay, so while that's in the oven, I'm gonna show you guys what I bought at Loft today when I was shopping. I got a PETA mask, whoa, fancy. But these are actually more breathable, well definitely more breathable than cloth mask, but even more so than those white generic masks. I prefer these, this is a pack of three and it was about 300 yen. But the really interesting thing that I got that I haven't told you to yet is I got this, hold on, hold on. Cooling mask spray. Babe, I got cooling mask spray. Awesome, I wanna try it. Let's, let's try it, I wanna try it. I, want, I gotta try it tomorrow. I know, but we should just try right now to see how it feels. I wonder if it's really gonna like make it cooler, like does it smell, is it gonna make me break out even more? All the possibilities. It smells like that bug spray that I was telling you guys before. Babe, it smells like the bug spray I like. I'm too excited. Babe, smell my hand. Oh yeah. Oh, I can live in this scent. I don't think that fabric of the mask doesn't 
dissolve water. What? Gotta let it dry first. Yes, yeah, Well, I'm sorry, I'm a little grouchy right now. Cause I got some cancellations. Oh, that's fine. But it's fine. It happens. Nothing's permanent in 2020. Nothing is permanent in 2020. <sighs> Ooh. What's funny is this that it says it's called the company, the brand is called Herbal Brain. I didn't talk about 